ladies and gents, I'm the Rev. This is the Long Dark. My fire went out. We're going over the update version 256, the Deep Forest. And as you can see, we're, uh, oh, I didn't hit my coffee like I wanted to. Oh, well, we're down to embers. Will it work? Will it work? I don't know, I've never tried it off the embers. Eh, maybe, maybe not. Alrighty, so they've updated. As you can see, we're in a nasty ass storm here. Didn't want to start someplace too damn cozy. With the way you harvest things, and it's a lot easier now, there's either small trees to chop down in case of the bow and arrow. We've been wanting to look for these small miniature trees. And of course, now I can't find. Really? <laughs> Never fails when you're trying to record something. Oop, now I'm too high up here. That's okay. I know where I am, which is good. So, I won't get lost. Believe it or not, the storm wasn't like this when I came out. Good, we're gonna get our asses frozen off. So, anyways, it goes along with the other harvesting mechanics now and you can, that you can do indoors, which of course is, uh, I'll show you guys that in a second. Here we go, back to the farmstead. I guess we will go inside for a bit. Man, well, though, first things first. Nope, doesn't look good enough. How about here? Ah, okay. So you guys see down there in the left-hand corner, there's now a mechanic. Anytime you are completely blocked from the wind, not the cold, the wind, you'll see that mechanic down in the bottom left corner. We'll just go on inside here and I can show you guys how to do the forging. So this works for any sticks. Um, you can find the uh, fir and cedar on the ground as well. Go how long is that gonna take? Two hours, that's a little long. How about a chair? An hour. Oh, God. Okay. So we just break it on down. There you go. And then you can see what you get. Now with the um, cedar wood, you get uh, uh, the tinder plugs, I think. I think usually that's what you get. Some of them you do, some of them you don't. Of course, you always need your various forces of tin uh, tinder still. Let's see, and then of course they've updated the outdoor fire mechanic. So where I started, now you have to actually keep the fire going and it, oh, really? An hour and that storm passed? Damn! Anyways, let's see. Do 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 there we go. We'll start the fire here. I'm out of accelerant up um and I'll explain why a little bit later. Also, they have an updated wolf struggle that we'll talk a little bit about here. Um, they've changed it, and I have footage of that as well as so I get mauled by a wolf, and I try using the bow and arrow, the bow and arrow, and it stunned him, and then he came after me again, which sucked. And then after I get mauled, I show the update first aid system. So you guys will want to stick around for that. Now you can see plus 2C, right? So what that means is it is warm enough with our warmth bonus and chill bonus that it will keep us warm for a certain amount of time. You have to keep the fire hot enough that it offsets the outside elements, which are now drastically going to change. Storm starts back up. Well, eventually it'll change. But there you go. So that is the new updated campfire system. Of course, you want to, like I said before, as I showed, you just go over here 
and you can see that symbol down the corner that shows you are blocked so you make your fire here if you're out in the wilds which you're going to have to be which is the la uh, last thing we're going to talk about real quick here is what they've done to slow the game down so to begin with i have been outside for maybe a half hour our time two hours game time my fatigue is already halfway there my hunger huge thirst huge right so what they've done one of the, the one of the first things that they did is they made it so that now your hunger and your thirst goes up faster what that means is it slows you down constantly because you're always foraging for food which means you have to, and you're not going to be able to get from um, area to area unless you learn how to hunt by the time i made it here um, I was trying to prolong my stay, so I started hunting. That's why you guys will see me eating bear meat. But the fatigue also, so on top of you having to additionally search for food and water, you now have got to not rest a whole bunch more. I'll tell you guys exactly how much more here in a sec, but from what we, um, before this patch, now keep in mind, folks, that this is patch is the first one, I think, for the Xbox One owners out there, as well as PC guys. We've had a bunch of patches, but this is the first one for them. And the first thing that they do, or it's one of the first few patches, is they slow the game down. Now, the other major thing that they did was up in the right-hand corner, you see that little thing up there going down? That's your stamina bar. That's how fast you can run. This is how fast you can walk. See how we're going here? See how fast that goes down? Now I'm just walking. See how it takes forever to get back up? We would have to stand here for like a half hour game time. Or I'll at least get out of the wind. So we'll see how long we got to stand here. See I'm blocked by the wind now. And that, that's it. Really? So they didn't have this mechanic before, which means you could sprint as much as you wanted to. It would burn through your food and um, your, your fatigue, but about half as fast as it does now. So I've been testing this, and you can see there, we've barely got anything left now. I mean, come on, really? So we'll go inside real quick, which is a little bit quieter. And I've been doing extensive testing, and from what I've seen, I started um, this game. And we'll go into the log. We're at day 32. Okay. Normally, it takes me about a week and a half to get to the point where I am now, fully, fully geared. And that's game time. In game time. Um, maybe a week, week and a half tops to get to where I am. So they've made it now. It take for someone that knows all the tricks, the ins and outs, the shortcuts, everything. Almost four times as long to get to where I am. Now, I, developers tend to do this for two reasons. One is because they've been told their game's too short and someone big is backing them. Well, now Microsoft and Xbox One is now backing this game. You know they're just not letting it on their service for no reason. So that means that they're going to have a say in it to an extent. Now, it could be that. And they could be saying more content, bigger, better, whatever. Second one is they don't have that much more content. In other words, they might have one more area, maybe two, if that, if we're lucky, maybe one, more likely than not, and then they have the story mode, and then that's all it's going to be. So they added, they went and they stripped away all the stuff so that they can make the game longer. Because that's all this does. It just prolongs the experience. I personally don't really care for that. So, we'll hold on a second, folks. I'm going to go rest, and in the meantime, you guys get to see me get attacked and eaten by a wolf. Which, you know, if you watch a lot of my long dark videos, you'll see that kind of happens a lot. That or bear. So, hold on a second.
Oh, I got him. Is he dead? Uh-oh. Ah, no he's not. Oh my god, what the hell? Oh, shit. There we go. That's right, get off me, bitch. Okay, so, for the first aid, you treat your wounds. And of course, treat... Oh, now it's going to take and treat wounds and that. There we go. So now we're at 68%. See how high my fatigue shot up? Or it's already shot up, I should say. <laughs> Alrighty, folks, we are back. And the reason we're outside is for you PC users, anytime you use the fire mechanic, be it a stove and door, a fire barrel, it just jacks up my uh, graphics card. It added ooh, 40 degrees Celsius to it just on the, on, on the fire mechanic. So I was like, I'm not going to do my outro from there. No. It's a warning out there for all the PC users. I don't know, uh, Xbox users, if they're going to fix that for your guys' version or not. Anyways, if you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up, like, subscribe, share. Help my channel out. I appreciate it as always. The more you guys help me out, the more stuff like this I can bring you. So as always, I shall see you real soon. Keep your heads down, your asses up. And I'll see you next time if the gods don't get me first. What is this damn weather? <laughs>